little late to make this video. I meant to do this like a month ago, but I have been so busy and time has just flown by and here we are already halfway through February. My plan for the day was to come in here and clean up the office a little bit. My gear is kind of scattered everywhere right now. It's a bit of a problem. And then I realized I planned on doing a 30 day review of all of my Foley gear. So the Foley Jarvis desk, the chair, standing mat, all of the accessories. I wanted to do basically a 30 day review after using everything every day for 30 days. And it's already been two months now. So I guess now I'm gonna give you guys my 60 day review of everything that Foley sent over. Also, I just had to show you guys how close I am to roast being in the same building. It's dangerous being that close to really good coffee. And I guess this can give you like a little preview as to what you can expect on the channel soon. Konica Hexar AF Silver, uh, that's on loan from KEH right now. I'm doing a full review on that. Uh, full follow-up review on the X-Pan with all three lenses. That's currently being borrowed from Phil from the darkroom. Olympus XA. Forrest Mankins sent this over to me very kindly, and uh, I'm doing a review and giveaway of this camera. So a lot of film camera reviews are currently in the works and on the way, so stay tuned for that. Also, you might notice it's pretty bare back here. Uh, I no longer have my 27 inch monitor and my MacBook up on another monitor arm. I've actually ditched my 27 inch monitor. I felt like having both screens was just too much. After using everything for a couple of months, it was just too much, too distracting, too overwhelming. I've since gotten rid of those and I'm just working off of the MacBook Pro by itself, so that works much better for me. It's much more my speed, um, but I am going to have something for that wall to kind of fill that space, so I'll show more details of that once it comes in. Um, for now, you can just see my little YouTube plaque, which I'm not going to lie, pretty excited to finally have that. I should also mention there is gonna be a full office tour like I've talked about where I kind of go through in depth all of the different equipment and gear that I use on a daily basis. That is coming, but as you can tell, like I just mentioned, I'm changing things up a little bit here and there and just kind of tweaking things to best fit my needs. So once everything is like really dialed in and figured out, then I'll do a full office tour. Okay, now let's talk about fully. So if you guys watched my office setup video, you know that I've partnered up with Fully, which I am really, really excited about. I've wanted to work with them for a long time, so to finally be able to do that, it's really, really cool. Uh, as a Fully partner, they have basically furnished my office. So they've sent me the Jarvis standing desk, the Capisco chair, the move mat, plenty of different accessories. I get to use these products on a daily basis. They sent everything over entirely free and I just get to talk about it, which it is not lost on me how fortunate I am to do that. I am extremely thankful. I never imagined to be able to do stuff like this so fully. Thank you very much for letting me partner up with you. Again, I really appreciate that. So what I'm gonna do today is kind of talk to you guys about what it is fully sent over and give you my honest opinion on everything. Um, although they did provide everything and I am partnered up with fully, I'm gonna give you my honest opinion, things that I like about every product and also things that I think could be improved on on every single product. So just keep that in mind. For starters, we're gonna talk about my favorite thing in this office and that is the Jarvis standing desk. So this is the Jarvis standing desk. This thing is rock solid. It's actually been updated pretty recently. This is the newest version of it with increased stability, a new OLED touchscreen display to control everything. I absolutely love working from this thing. It's the 30 by 60 inch size, which there are a lot of different sizes and shapes and options to kind of fully customize it. And you can really build it out however you want. I just went with the really straightforward 30 by 60 inch size with this bamboo top, which just looks incredible. You can add a lot of different accessories to the desk, like this drawer right here I added. So that way anything like pins, paper, hand sanitizer, because the entire world is sick right now, this just screws into the bottom of the desk and it's super handy to just have to keep the kind of everyday stuff, as well as these powered grommets. I only have one. It comes with the option to add these grommet holes. So if you want to run cables underneath the desk through this, you can do that. I have one of them taken up with this powered grommet, so it has your standard three prong outlet as well as a USB-A and USB-C. Being able to charge everything on top of the desk is super convenient. I don't have to run cables underneath or off to the side. I'm actually gonna pick up another one of those to put on this side because I use it all the time. Now the main reason somebody would actually buy the Jarvis desk is because it's a sit stand desk. So if you like to stand whenever you're working, this is a great option, but it's also powered and you can actually just go back and forth anytime you want. 
super convenient. I find myself going from sitting and standing and back and forth throughout each day and just as long as I'm staying moving and kind of changing things up, it just kind of helps me stay focused a little bit. Now right now this is at the typical standing height that I normally use and you can actually dial it in by really small increments. So if I wanted to drop it just a little bit, I just hit the down button, go back up. I can hold it in if I want to make more kind of like dramatic changes or there's actually a built-in memory and you can program preset heights. So right now, if I were to hit number two, it's gonna drop down to my preferred height for sitting. So anytime throughout the day, if I feel like sitting down, I can just hit one button. It's already kind of dialed in based on my own personal preference. So if you're sharing a desk with somebody and you all have your own kind of preferred heights, this is a great system. Or like me, I'm the only one working here. I just use two of the presets, one for standing, one for sitting. It's really convenient. All in all, I absolutely love this thing. We'll talk about cable management in a minute because everything underneath, you don't see any cables hanging Hanging down everything is kept nice and tidy underneath one thing that I would say could probably be improved upon is the touchscreen display it's a new feature so this is their first kind of touchscreen display from what I'm aware of sometimes it doesn't like register my thumbprint to kind of like wake it up every single time sometimes I have to find like just the right spot in order for it to turn back on it works, obviously. I just am looking for anything that I can give in terms of like constructive feedback in order to make the products better. I really had to think hard to try and find something in order to make this better because honestly, I love this desk. But now we'll hop underneath the desk to kind of show some of the cable management. Oh, I just realized what I'm wearing today, this Beartooth hoodie. My buddy Cameron, who plays in Beartooth, he sent over some of their new merch. Uh, fun fact, if it weren't for Cameron and taking photos of his old band years ago, I never would have met my wife. So, a little fun fact for you. Thanks, Cameron. Their cable management kit actually includes these trays here that are just screwed into the bottom of the desk and that just keeps the surge protector, all the cables nice and tidy, as well as these little kind of zip tie type things with adhesive mounts to keep everything nice and tidy up to the bottom of the desk. That way you don't actually have any cables hanging down. So, cables managed. So now we should probably talk about this guy. This is the move mat. So this is a standing mat that you use whenever you're gonna be standing. You can do this with shoes or with your socks. I typically do this with my socks on and I'll explain why. This thing is amazing. Whenever they first sent everything over, they mentioned that they were gonna go ahead and throw this in as well, even though I hadn't really requested it. They just said, we think you might really like this. And at first, not gonna lie, I was pretty skeptical. Online it says that this is supposed to mimic like walking through nature. There are peaks and valleys you can kind of see a little bit. It's hard to really get on camera because it's all inside the foam here underneath the top layer. But basically this is meant to kind of add different layers as if you were walking through the woods barefoot, you know? You're not just walking on something flat, there are different things there. And I thought that sounds like a gimmick, I'm not gonna lie. But this thing has been amazing. It's honestly like having a foot massage while you're actually standing there working. I tend to fidget, I kind of pace back and forth a little bit if I'm standing there working at my desk and having this thing underneath me, one, it's padded so it's nice and comfortable, but just the feeling of everything there, it actually feels really, really good. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what this is really like and this is gonna be weird. So as you can see, if I were here working, look down, here we are. At least I'm wearing my nice socks today, how about that? Stance? You wanna hook me up? No, but I'll try and demonstrate like right here, here's a spot where there's a big peak and then it kind of dips down, here's another peak. It's all kind of random and I'll just find myself as I'm working kind of fidgeting a little bit. This is the weirdest thing I have ever done on this channel, but no joke, this thing is awesome. Okay, um, now that we all know each other on a much more personal level, let's talk about this chair. So when it comes time to actually sit down for a little bit and get some work done, this is the Capisco chair, and this is by far my favorite office chair I have ever used. Anytime somebody stops into the office, this is always one of the first things they comment on because it is a really unique design chair, but that's all with the function in mind. Typically, your office chair is gonna give you one option to sit. You're gonna sit right here, you usually have a couple armrests, and you're gonna be facing right here with your feet in front of you. This is kinda meant to be able to move and turn and sit in a number of different ways, 
basically kind of fitting however you might like to sit. Now, 99% of the time, I'm using it like a regular chair. I'm just sitting here like this. Uh, I have it set to, you know, basically my height. I can kind of adjust different things and all of the normal adjustments are there, but you can turn it and sit in it a number of different ways. So if I wanted to sit in it sideways like this, it kind of gives you a little bit of a cutout for your legs there. You can kind of rest with your arm on the side. If I sit any other way, this is typically the way I like to do it. Although you do have the option to pull what I like to call the AC Slater and you can sit in it backwards, you know, like you're the, uh, you're the substitute teacher who just wants to show the kids, hey, I'm just like you. I'm cool, I'm hip. Those are actually two things that I am not, but it is cool that it gives you the option to kind of sit and use the chair however you might want to. I could see some people saying that it needs to be a little bit sturdier. Some of the pieces kind of wiggle a little bit more than some people might want, but other than that, this thing is solid. The monitor arms that I mentioned earlier, where my 27 inch monitor and my MacBook Pro, they used to be up there, let me show those. These are the monitor arms from Fully. They work really great. They're nice and solid. They're super, super tough. So these can hold a lot of weight, um, plenty of articulation. They work great. I just simply wanted to switch to just my MacBook Pro and not an external monitor again. So if you do need a monitor arm, although I'm not using these anymore, they're great. If you've never tried a standing desk before, I definitely think you should at least give it a try. And you don't have to really buy anything right off the bat just to try it out. I used to use these metal shelves that I got from like Sam's Club. If you've been a follower or subscriber for a long time, you probably remember seeing those in some of my older videos. Those definitely aren't meant to be standing desks. I just took the top half of the shelf off and tried to use them as standing desks. And I really like that aspect. I like being able to stand whenever I'm working. I just feel a little bit more kind of free to kind of bounce around whenever I have a bunch of different things to do. But whenever I want to kind of sit down and really focus on like a video edit or editing wedding photos, anything like that, then I like being able to have the option to sit as well. But if you haven't tried standing and working, you should definitely give it a shot. A lot of people will stack up like shoe boxes or something at a countertop or a kitchen table or something like that and put their computer on top of it. Just try something like that out if you never have before because it might actually work better for you. But if you are in the market for a standing desk, I highly, highly recommend the Jarvis standing desk. It has sort of become the standard of standing desks. It is rock solid and Foley has been really kind enough to offer a $50 off coupon for you guys valid through the end of February. So for the rest of this month, if you place anything over $500, you're going to get $50 off just using the code here. I can't remember off the top of my head. Here's the code. It's also down in the links below. Definitely check that out if you guys are interested and save yourself some money. Fully, thank you guys so much for letting me partner up with you. It's been amazing. Not only are your products great, but just having the kind of relationship I've had with Fully, it's been amazing. They're great people, and that is just as valuable to me as the product. If there are good people involved, that's the kind of people I want to work with and support. So big thanks to Fully. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have any questions at all, please leave them in the comments down below. If you're new here, there are new videos every Monday at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So that's it for today. Thank you guys for everything. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.